Assalamu alaikum guys once again I'm back I hope you are all fine in this video I'll show you how to set up your windows 10 for the first time the quick method the easiest method to set up your windows 10 for the first time and some important set steps to make your windows more um, better like the performance the look and everything in this video I'll try to cover the first thing ever you need to go with the browser now in your case if you are using the windows 10 latest version you definitely have the microsoft edge just open it after opening the microsoft edge you need to open a website called nite.com n-i-n-t-e uh, n-i-n-i-t-e.com on this website, this website will provide you lot of free softwares and tools that are actually important for the first uh, for the first time. Now you can download all these tools with one click. Simply select all the tools that you want actually, and then simply you need to click to click on the download button. Now I have lot of downloaded software. Some uh, are I'll show you some uh, softwares uh, and tools. To download just simply select I'm going to select discord and then a media player now if you thinking about the media player there are a lot of list available but the best media player is Klyde Kotec just go with that this is the perfect otherwise you can also go with VLC if you don't know about the VLC VLC have a lot of features just check out my i button video it will show you 12 different future of VLC that other players not providing you you can record yourself you can download videos and music using VLC after selecting the tools simply click on the get your 90 and your download will be started if it's not starting the download simply click on retry the download and it will start downloading now simply click on the download now open it now it's all depend on your internet performance it will take a few seconds And now process is begin you can also see your list that you have selected and now it's downloading one by one automatically on your background after that it will close automatically let's move on the step number two okay just open this PC now simply click on view folder option and general tab you can uncheck the privacy options and clear it the second way is click on view and there are lot of features are available you can tweak it by yourself you want to see thumbnails or icon you can select from here a lot of other features are available but I'm not uh, going with these uh, kind of setups just scroll down and select this option the last one show library because it's important sometimes you need to open the library so this is the way you can simply select here then go in the last option and just check this option hit apply and ok you can also select here open file explorer as a this PC instead of the quick access so quick access sometimes make you uh, annoying so you can select this PC directly go into the driver list as you can see on my background just select that option this PC and hit apply ok now let's move on the third option this time simply click on the windows icon and then go into the settings now go into the privacy just uncheck all these privacy options so this will make your internet more reliable then go into the diagnostic and feedback scroll down and feedback frequency just click on it and select the never then scroll down from the left side and find the background apps I have already turned off all the applications you can turn off all the applications for better performance let's move on next step 
click on the windows icon then type ms configuration config and then go here into the services hide all microsoft services and now you can see here a lot of services are installed in your pc uh, and they are running on your background sometimes so just you can unselect all the applications uh, all the services that are uh, unnecessary the actually uh, some applications are important like the Intel graphic uh, controller control panel and Nvidia display and VGC uh, these kind of applications are important on your background it will help you to improve your graphic performance and also the VGC uh, service that work with my Valorant actually so I'm not gonna disable it otherwise you can disable all the uh, services now sometimes it's happening that automatically notepad and some other files are opening on your desktop you can simply select the start normal and uh, your windows will operate normally as the first time it's happened so simply select that option and hit apply okay that's it now click on the boot advanced option number of process select the maximum size of your course hit apply okay now let's move on the last step attach your usb drive and then simply go into the properties of your usb now go into the ready boost now you can see i can't use this feature because my computer is already in a fast so ready boost uh, is not uh, you know unlikely providing me some additional benefits so I'm not gonna apply this uh, even I can't but in your case you will get here the three options but select the use this device and then select the maximum size of your USB drive then simply click apply and ok now let's move on the uh, my computer properties now this time scroll down and go here the advanced system settings advanced and then performance settings now again advanced then on the bottom virtual memory just change it now in your case automatically manage packing file size uh, for all the drivers just uncheck this option now click on the custom size and put here the value of your USB memory now if you don't know just again go into your PC check out your USB size it's 14.4 GB but uh, you need to convert it into a MB if you don't know simply open any browser After opening the browser, simply open the Google Chrome and type here 14.4 GB to MB. Hit enter. You will get result. Just simply copy and paste it in both filling the blanks. The initial size and the maximum size. Put it here. Click OK, OK, OK and close it. That's it guys. That's the way you can improve your performance and uh, set up your Windows 10 fastly. I hope you like this video. Please hit the subscribe button and share it with friend. If you have any question, just drop your comment. I'll respond to you as soon as possible for me. And uh, if you are facing any software encounter error, then just drop your comment. I'll respond to you. And uh, let's find some solution together. I hope you like this video. Please hit the subscribe button. See you in the next video. Take care. Allah Hafiz. Bye bye.